Peace and hearken all ever, rich and poor, young and old, men and women that be here, both late and loud, stout. And hearken all ever, rich and poor, young and old, men and women that be it here, both late and loud, stout and old. Lordings and ladies that be at hand, hearkeneth all with mild mood. Thus our game shall begin and end. Lord, us well speed that shed his blood. Now stand it still and be at hand, and pray for the tomorrow's weather. And ye shall, ere ye head to end, be glad that ye come hither. He shall in his birth, of birth, and eat of care. Hearken and I will you tell, how the proud shall fare. Of the king of life I will you tell, he standeth first before, all men that be of flesh and fell, and of woman in war. He is for so, so strong to stand, and becoming a king, he giveth laws throughout the land, and dread no fear. In pride and liking his life he leadeth, Lord, he looketh with us. Prince and dukes, him seeth, him dreadeth, he dreadeth no death for to die. He hath a lady, lovely all that like him. Name a he of no more, men no miss. He seeth in sweetness, and set his liking, and bring his veil bound into bliss. Knights yet punny in dreadful limbs, do I never man such a cunning wisdom? Which help the deal much of his might, or boast too much of his bliss. And he's sorry we sit in his sight, and mirth making him taste. Here stands also the Lady of Land, the fairest the Lord for to late. Glad may he be for to stand and behold that blissful day. That lady is lettered in law, as comely becomes it for a queen. And moved the maid evermore, as a dare for greater to teed. She bid him beware of his smart, of death or a land in his land. She loved him go skipping heart, and bid him beware of his hand. She began to chart with care these words without lacing. Death does not spare my kindest knee king. Now, Lord, leave thy liking, which bringeth the soul great bail. This answer she had of the king. Yea, this is a woman's tale. The king it me took not to heart, for it was a woman's speech. And yet it made him to smart, when him might help of no leech. The queen began to understand what help there might be, and sent out to the bishop of the land, to peach out more than she. He came and he preached all he cared, and warned him wholly on his end. <coughs> it saved not in the king's mouth, but home he back and went. When the bishop was home went, from that stern strife, to death a messenger then sent, was by the king of life. The king him would do understand, that all he made out at night, he nay would come into his own land, on him to quit his might. Death cometh, it dreameth in a dreadful dream, well or all care, and soon strength and health, and then him, he me would not spare. Soon it befell that death and life, be it together in tight, Guinness and strife of a strong sky, strife, the king of life to reign. With him dreadeth the lungs blow, he dreadeth nothing his nights, and delve with him deep death's wound and kiss on him his mates. When the body is down he brought, the soul's sorrow awaketh. The body's pride is dear, bought. His soul, the fiend's maker. And through prayer of Our Lady Mild, all goodness she will requite.
and pray her son so mild, the soul and body shall despite. The cause that ne'er no care, no more than stone in way, we shall know sorrow and sore care, and lie between them twain. The soul thereof shall derail, that the fiends have a good, and our lady shall therefore pray, so that with her he shall be left. Now be it in peace, and be at pain, and disturb not our place, for this our gain shall begin and end. Through Jesus Christ, be grace. Peace now, ye princes of power so proud, ye kings ye kept ye knights ye called, ye barons bold that beat me about, hear now my sword ye swings. Squire stout, stun it now still, and listen it to my lessons. I walk you now here, or I shall work you more, with works of will, and down shall ye drive me never so dear. King I am, king of kings ye call, all the wide world to will that mine will. Was there never no man of whom ye born against me with son that I know his skill? Lord of land, be it my name. All men shall bow in hall and power. No man or tower. Boldly thou art my boot, trusty and full true. Of all my rest thou art root. I will change for no you. All well I am be wet. May no Christian thing be grow. Like it is with me be let. All things is at my behold. Strength and health, night's head, doughty dares in me. Look that for no thing ye let smartly to be speed. Bring it with you, bright brand, helms bright and sheen. For I am lord over all lands, and that is well seen. My lord, in truth, thou might trace faithfully to stand. Thou might live as thee list, for plenty is thou found. I am strength, stiff and strong. Never is such none in all this world brought long in age of blood and bone. Have no doubt of no thing that ever may befall. I am strength, thy darling, flower of night's all. King of life, I swear to the crown as his skin and right. I am health, I come to tend thy kind, courteous knight. Thou art lord of limb and life, and king without an end. Stiff and strong and stern in strife in land where thou art wed. Thou hast no need to sigh sore, for no one online. Thy should live forevermore. Dead thee strive. Strive? Nay, to me who is so good? It were but folly. There is no man in the dare go any of Whereof should I be when I am king of life? Full evil should he speed to me like virtue strife. I shall live evermore, and crown where as king. I mean may never wait of war, I live at my king. Sire, sayest as thou livest, thou livest at thy will. For something that thou missed, and therefore hold thee still. Think, thou hadst a beginning when thou were a war, and that thou make good ending, thy soul is for law. Love God, holy church, and have of him some eye. For his works to watch, and think that thou shalt die. Do thou, why sayest thou so? Thou speakst not as he sigh. I shall live ever hope for both to thy life. Wouldest thou that I were dead, that thou might have a new? Or the devil girt off thy neck, and that word shall be. Dead, sire, nay. God won my will than he kept my lord. It would than he thought ill work there to ought. Yet though thou be king, need shall have end. Death overcometh all things. Howsoever we went. Dad, thou hast words fair. It cometh thee of kind. This is but a woman's tale, and that I will be fine. I me shall never die, for I am king of life. Death is under mine eye. Therefore leave thy strife. Thou dost but make my heart so, for it will not help. I pray, speak of him no more. 
I thought of him yet. Yeah. Help, sire. Nay, so note I thee, I'll it not therefore. But kind teach it both thee and me. First when we were born, for doubts of death mastery. To weep and make sorrow, holy writ and prophecy thereof I take to borrow. Therefore, whilst ye have might, and the world at will, I read ye serve God Almighty, both loud and still. This world is but fantasy and full of treachery. Good sire, for thy courtesy, take this for no folly, and ye say it for no fable. Death will smite thee. In faith, look thou the student. What, preachest thou of death smites, and of his mastery, he will burst by me in his fight for both his eyes. Strength and health, what say ye, my kind colleague knights? Shall death be lord over me, and leave me but lights? My lord, so break I my wrongs. God, that make me be, that death should do me wrong, while I am in my kingdom, while I am in my feet. I will withstand him with strife, and make his sides bleed, and tell him that thou art king of life, and lord of land and lead. If by chance we should meet in with this long art, in film or in straight, I will give him this chance. Yea, these be nights of courtesy, and the doubts he may with thee, of death be of his mastery, me and I will protect. Where is mirth my messenger, swift as leaf on limb? He is a noble bachelor that runs by a wind. Mirth and sorrow he can make and run so the road, like he be more than it where so ever he go. Come and hear my talents, and all the kind of life. Where any man as thou hast wealth, thus with me to strive. King of life, and lord of land, as thou sits on thy sea, and flourishes with thy bright brand, to thee I sit on thee. I am her, and all thy works, thy merry messenger, that hopes thou her, without boast, then never was my peer, doubt me to have done a deed, that ye have fought you done. Hem, to bury upon tweed, and come again full soon. There is nothing be ye like in all of this world wide, of gold and silver and robes rich, and high horse on to ride. I have been both far and near, in battle and in strife. Oh, there was never thy peer, for thou art king of land. Ah, sorry, now thou sayest, so thou mayest me in my room. Thou shalt go in, ere thou canst go be advanced by me. Thou shalt have for thy good will, to thy advancement, the castle of Gallisburg on the hill, and the Earl of Kent. Draw the cord of thy strength, lest I will now take, on earth in breath be left, he never was my age. Unwrit. Slept clever men, be it blind, look at all the mist that 
they become as unkind. That is truth. You wish. Friends may no man find of stranger or of sin, and dead being out of mind, great sorrow it is to live. These rich men be it ruthless, the poor goeth to ground, and false men be it shameless. That is true, be found. It is wrong. The rich like all that the poor does, and that is seen day and night. What so will say sooth? Paraventure men call me a fool to say that sooth tale. They affair it as fishes in a pool. The great eateth the small. Rich men spare for no thing to do the poor wrong. They think it not on their aiming, beyond death that is so strong. Neither they love it, nor do I dread it, neither him nor his laws. Towards hell fast he draweth against their ending days. But God, in his goodness, give him grace to remain. For into the delightful darkness they go without end. There is dread and sorrow and woe without him. Well, no man may other borrow, be he never so fair. Lord, that for thy manhood and also for thy good, for love and not for dread, died upon the rude. Give thy grace of life, to let that be thy soul's remedy. God of heaven in his Godhead, love that it so be. Amen. way that thou shalt win, but thou be busy. Think that thou art short-lived man, and had a beginning, and evermore have thoughts upon thy dreadful ending. Thou shalt think on, and make thee ever young, that death is not the man, for no thing will thee spare. Thou shalt, thou shalt do deeds of chat, and, and learn Christ's law, and live in heaven lit to save thy soul. For a soul. What? Bishop, Bishop Barrow, should I of death have dread? Thou art but a child, but my soul hold thy way, I beg. What come thou therefore hither, with death me to a fear? Get thou and he both together into the sea, Scott. But death will come. Go home. God gave his soul to I see in my mood. Where will thou preach tomorrow, though not there by the mood? Trouse thou I would be dead in my young life. Thou liest, screw, bulkhead, evil what thou thrive. What should I do at church? What? Sir Bishop, what should do? Church, it is the white cat that will bite. I shall let care away and go on my testing to Hunting and to other things for all thy preaching. I am king. As thou might see, and have no need to shout, the wild queen and my knee about me be young. Think, sire. One other tryst, that thing that thou missed soon, he did now, as thee list, but death will come right soon and give thee, give thee death's wounds for thine outrage within a little stound. Then art thou but a page, a 
And when thou art graven on green, there beats flies with mould and helpeth little by me. What do I mean by gay crown of gold? Son, have a good day. Christ, I need to teach. Farewell, Bishop Darwin, and the better. Now, by my fate shall be seen, I throw it today where death me does cheat and meet in the way. Where art thou, my messenger? Search by thy name. Look that thou go far and wide, as thou wilt have no blame. My bands go to cry by days and by night. And look that thou spy by all thy might of death and of his mastery, where he does come in sight against me and my name with force of arms to fight. Look that thou go both east and west, and come again and on. Lord, join thy press. Lo, now I am gone. <coughs> Peace, and listening to my soul, both young and old, as ye will not be a soul, be ye never so bold. I am a messenger, I said, by the king of life, that ye shall fulfil his talent on pain of limb and life. He tests the hold and his law, each man in hand, lest ye be hanged, or to draw, or cast in hard land. Ye wish and wealth that he is king, and lord of all lands, keeper and master of all things within sea and sands. I am sent for to inquire about far and near, if any man dare war a rib against such a bachelor, to roll for hell, he was in war, that would with him strive. Be him sick here, he is in all, as here in this life, though it were the king of death, and he so hard he were, but he he hath, might be meth, the king of life to a fear. Be he so hardy, or so good, in this land to arrive, he will see his heart blood, and he with him strive. I'm going to do it like a man.